the long-awaited and the cooking of the sausage slammers. I took the sausage slammers from the Southside Market and Barbecue, put them in a heavy-duty plastic bag. We put it in a water bath called the sous vide method, 131 degrees Fahrenheit for a few hours, actually. We're going to open this in a second. Okay, first things first here. Take our sausage slammers out of our plastic bag. Place them. Here, they're nice and warm. Fully cooked. Okay, but it's just nice to, to have them uh, not, not only warm, but crispy. So we got the sausage slammers right here. We're going to put them on the barbecue. I've been heating a cast iron pan, pre-oiled. Put the slammers on there. And we're going to let that go for about five minutes. Okay, we're back at the grill. 450, about five minutes. A nice little crisp on the on the bacon there. Just a little bit nicer crisp, and we're gonna put that on for another mm, couple minutes. Okay, it's been a couple minutes. It's our slammers. I'm just gonna bring the slammers back over. Look at that. Gonna bring them over, rest them for a little bit so that the high melt cheddar doesn't scald the roof of my mouth. Phone's overheating, gotta get away from here. So I just cooled my phone off in the refrigerator. You're gonna see the before and after. Sausage slammer split open in half. Got that fresh jalapeno, high melt cheddar in the middle, wrapped with sausage. And the sausage is wrapped with bacon. Ooh, baby. Cheers. That jalapeno. I ate it. Not that spicy. They de seed it. Got the cheese and the sausage left. And the bacon. One half of a sausage slammer. Slam that baby down. Okay, I had to take a break, make sure the jalapeno didn't kill me. It didn't. A little latent spice, not much. Sausage is a bit spicy too, but not too bad. Have the rest of this this guy. Mm -hmm. And that's it, one whole sausage slammer slammed.